Hello everybody and welcome back to the Banning of Isaac After Birth Plus. We are back once again, once again. Did we, did we beat Greedier Mode last time as Kane, was it? Let's have a little look-see. Let's have a little look-see. We did. We did, we did, we did. We did. Oh no, we didn't! Ah! Let's try again. Let's try it again. <laughs> I was looking at Eden by accident. Let's try it again. We did we did attempt this, but it didn't go great. Spawn a chan and one hit. Uh, spawn stronger the more rooms you clear without taking damage. It's alright. Safety pin. Um, I thought safety pin... I always get safety pin mixed up with, is it matchbook? The one that gives you a bomb. Um, we've not got too much great stuff here. Do you know what? This is greedier mode, so let's do a little bit of cheesing. Do a bit of restarting. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Uh, and that's pretty good too. Okay, so we should get pretty decent tiers up going through this. I think it's every 11 coins or 12 coins, something like that, we get a tier rate up. I can never remember. I think it's 11. I can never quite remember. These guys will be pretty easy to take out. Don't really matter if these guys survive to the next wave. Because if, if anything, all they're going to do is let us hurt other things a little more. But yeah, we're trying to... Um, we're trying to pick up coins when we can. Also, remember when the coins are on the floor, they fear things, which is actually pretty useful for us. We'll take out this guy first. Oh, shit. I'm not going to be able to kill him in time. Oh, no, I got him. I got him. Okay, this guy shouldn't be too hard now that these flies have been fixed. Good, good, good. Okay, this is actually going all right. Having this extra fire right here is really helping out. We're on to how many coins now? Five coins. So we're still a little ways off. But as you can see here, these all these enemies are getting feared. Oh my god, look at the poop. The um, the poop face is feared. That's, that's kind of funny, actually. I'm going to end up sliding into um, one of these shots or the spiky button, aren't I? Okay, let's just be very careful and cautious. I don't mind being hit by that. Okay, I do mind being hit twice in a row, though. Oh, dude. This, this poop patch is it's actually really kind of... I, I actually quite like the fact that it can spawn on greedier mode. It is a very difficult wave enemy, kind of like the Sternies are, without being insane. Um, but it is, it is really annoying. But I do kind of love it. Oh my god, there's another wave. I didn't know there was another wave. We, we could die here. That fire there that's below us is a definite problem. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we're going to die here. Yep. The poop patch got me. The poop patch got me. The sliding around, it just makes it so difficult, and it means you have to constantly keep moving. This is a really good start. This is a really, really, really good start. Uh, definitely going to buy Torn Photo as well there. Do you know what? We've got a heart in there. Let's go in here. Three pennies. Not exactly the best in the world. We could maybe get up to five. Possibly with the items that are here. Possibly. Nah. No. It's not going to happen, is it? Either way. Right, but Telepathy for Dummies here, actually pretty good. Basically, Telepathy for Dummies right now is just Spoonbender. Like, we only have to activate it once and we get it for the entirety of the Greed Mode fight. So yeah, it's it's literally just having Spoonbender at this point, which is fantastic. Uh, homing isn't the best thing in the world, but it's pretty good. And it works pretty well with uh, some tier modifiers and stuff. So maybe we can get some things that synergize with it. I don't think using it twice will do anything. It didn't. I, I really highly doubt it would. But yeah, as you can see, our damage right now is, is really, really good for the floor that we're on. So I'm pretty happy about that. We should be absolutely fine to... To gank Supreme. Take some of these guys out. We've got a poop patch. Take him out, take him out, take him out. Okay, so that is one thing I will say about the poop patch. We've been talking about this uh, in the in the last run that we just had. Um, it should work the way Stonies do, though, where if you kill all the enemies on the wave, it disappears rather than stays around forever. Because it is real annoying. It's such a cool enemy, though. It's a really interesting design space, I think, that's not really been explored by any other modder. And I quite like it. It's pretty funny, and as, as long as you've got the speed, you can actually stay well well enough away from it. If you get caught in it, though, it can be a real problem, but we can stay well enough away. We can take this tears up as well to, to help us out quite a lot here. Very happy with that. We use this to pop onto this guy. I can never remember what the pink version of, of Haunt does. I think the pink version spawns spiders. Or is that the black version? We should kill it before we even get to find out. Yep. By the looks of it, it dead. Okay, we got pin here. A few of these dudes. It's gonna fire a bomb at us. That's not a problem. You're taken out pretty easily. Yeah, this is gonna be a super easy boss fight here. 
Onto the devil deal. Ooh, this is actually a kind of hard one. Uh, let's let's focus up on taking out the spawners first. I think we got that. Uh, just because we don't want to have too many things. Considering I believe these guys can spawn more adds. We don't want things spawning adds and then bosses spawning adds as well. It could just get real messy. Nice, I did that pretty easily. Deal the devil here. We got Krampus. Honestly, I would not be remiss. I would not be upset about um, a lump of coal here. Let's see if we get it. Uh, damn. No lump of coal. Right, we're going to the next floor. We don't have half price keys, so we'll wait to buy a key until the next floor because we could get a half price key down here. You're only saving two cent, but we might as well. So let's have a little look. Hey, and that has worked exactly as planned. Exactly as planned. Three dollar bill. Absolutely love it. Um, shot height, heal for two. That's really good. Okay, so got a little bit of a plan here. This guy is a beggar for cards, and we have two booster packs up here. So let's grab that and go and go and beg our cards to him. Does he just give you other cards? He's just a card swapper. Oh no, that that was it. Um, so we could reroll our stats. I'm I'm not really on board with stat rerolling right now. I don't really think it's going to be worth it for us. Eddie, please die. I think we got. Did we get the other Eddie? Apparently, sir. So. Nice and three dollar bill. Of course, is just going to be fun and nice to have. I always like um, fruit cake and three dollar bill things like that. These items are always really enjoyable for me. This is a pretty annoying enemy right now, um, having it as that version of the champion where it's firing even more shots than it normally does. We got through it. Just fine. Take out the spawners yet again here. We want to take out this guy because he is one of the shadow spawners. Okay, everyone, we got a poop patch again. This means we're going to have this poop patch around with us for the rest of um, this fight, unfortunately. This guy's healthy. Wow. But I think as long as we use our pretty high speed to stay well enough away, we should be fine. I'm just going to carry on here. Keep her going. I love those enemies. These enemies are so cool. Oh, damn. He spawned three big spiders. Oh, my God. That's a lot of spiders, dude. Ow. It's okay. Wasn't too bad. We keep getting, like, random stat ups from a uh, $3 bill as well. It's kind of hard to keep track of what's our actual stats and what isn't. Can you die, sir? There you go. Good, 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 good. I might as well do our deal with the devil one as well while we're here. Just be careful of little old, little old ghostly brimstone boy. I kind of want to take care of this dude first just because he fires creep everywhere. There you go. We got him. The creep is super annoying. A nice and easy, and what we get here: two black hearts and two soul hearts. Honestly, fine by me. And we get our half heart back as well. Right, we've got thirty coins here. Neither of these are, are worth getting. I'm just gonna take this um, and probably just be on our merry way. I'm not even gonna buy from this store. I'd rather not spend the money on rerolls. I know that we might not get a reroll on the next floor and it might end up worse, but either way. Smart Fly is honestly okay, and the plus look is fine. Not really going to influence us that much here. Uh, I'll take Speedball for the maximum speed. Uh, it didn't give us any shot speed, surprisingly. I was thinking it would. Um, we'll take that. We'll take that. Okay. Not much point in taking this, but you know what? I'll take it anyways. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll take all of these. Just to just to get the half price items and build build up a, a repertoire of items. Right, let's get our herming on. I love having this unlimited herming. It's so useful. With high damage, herming's even more useful because hitting every shot makes so much of a difference. Yeah, this guy's going to be not too bad for us. But all this extra range we just got and shot speed is going to be super helpful. Really? That guy just sucked me into him. Was he one of those champions that does that? Probably so. Okay. Oh my god, the amount of shots I fire when I'm next to one of these hollowed poops. <laughs> my fire rate increases so much.
It's crazy. With Herming as well, we can kind of do this and sit sit back and chill a bit. <laughs> That's crazy. Might as well just keep going on this. Get in line with me, dude. Let me hit you with all of these shots. There you go. Okay, we got tapeworms here. Tapeworms I find are pretty pretty telefraggy because there's just so much of them. I think there's just not enough space for them not to telefrag you. Doesn't bother me that much. Oh, we lost our burn heart there. That's a shame. Doesn't bother me that much, to be honest, because I, I can kind of understand it. Like I said, there's so many of the worms that it's hard for them not to telefrag. Can, can, hey, dude. Can you, like, try and hit me, please? Again, we'll just go for it again. We're going to have plenty of uh, stuff to trade here. This is probably... Oh, my God. Firemind got me. This is probably the worst combination of uh, enemies you can possibly get. The Quad Sister Viz. Just because of that attack there. That attack there makes things... Look at that. Look at that. How How is one man meant to dodge that? Especially when they're off-screen doing that. So now we have double angry Sister Viz right now, which is not great. Okay, we got it, though. We got it. Annoying, but we did it. <sighs> Can someone fix Greed Mode Angel and Devil deals? Why do they never give me any items? Also, like, could I have a good item, please? Take a bunch of bombs here, just because it means we can do some re-rolling later on. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. Um, Number one. Probably not the best idea, but our range is pretty high, so it should be okay. Teardrop, I'll take that. Exclusive access. Don't know what that does. Yeah, I'll probably take the eyedropper there. Okay, get our Herman going. But yeah, you can see our range actually hasn't taken too big of a hit here. Okay, that guy just bashed his way into me. I feel like our damage is getting is like falling off a bit here. That's that's a cool enemy. I've not seen that enemy before, but I like it. I'm probably going to hate it when it actually hits me, but right now I like it. Ah, yeah, that hit me. Had a feeling. Oh, hello. That's a lot of heads coming at me. That I can't seem to dodge. No. We're getting a lot of stuns here. Um, A lot of stuns. We seem to be getting Mum's Eye a hell of a lot in our random... Items. Oh, there's a brimstone laser that I didn't see. Hello there. Okay, first boss fight shouldn't be too hard. Stay at the bottom of the screen and fight little Loki. I mean, he's going to teleport away. That's inevitable. Um, but our smart fly is doing great damage here. This is why the smart fly is so good, because we're bound to get hit. So it just kind of stays active for the rest of the, uh, the room, which is great. Wait. Oh, okay, I was like, is there double little Loki here? That's the next wave. The next wave is more little Lokis. It's two more. So now there's three little Lokis. I don't know which one I'm firing at. Was that the old one or the new ones? I think that was the old one. I think these two down here are the new ones. Should be pretty quick to kill, though. There you go, Mum's Eye again. Never really understood why these guys spawn bomb flies. Doesn't make... A whole hell of a lot of sense. Okay, double cage. This is this is difficult depending. It might be fine. It really depends on how their attacks combine. If they do like opposing attack patterns that are really hard to dodge, then it's fine. We managed to kill one of them like separately anyway, so we should be absolutely fine here. And smart fly is absolutely going off. Nice one. Another angel deal. Yet again. No fucking items. Like, what, what is it with, with Angel and Devil deals that just don't want to give you items in Greed Mode? So annoying. 
That's not going to do anything for us, is it, Mr. Dolly? Let's just buy a key and get out of here. I probably should have waited till the next floor to buy that key, but... Heck you, I'll do what I want. I don't know what the exclusive access does either, so I don't want to try and finagle away to try and buy that, because it might be terrible. Um, chance for a tier to do um, 3.2 times damage, but I have all special effects removed. Honestly, that's great. I'm, I'm completely fine with that. An extra range is also really good. Um, we have depression. Creates a treasure chest nearby. It's pretty decent. So it'll basically when we fire it, it won't take it take on any of the effect any of the effects of three dollar bill. What the fuck is this conga line of death? Uh, nor will it take on the uh, homing. So we'd have to be aware of that. But three point two times damage is insane. Now that's a lot of damage. Oh, I like these candle guys. These candle guys are cool. Also, that purple fire will be there forever now. So get used to it, sister. And it'll fire at us too. So. But yeah, this, this one item should up our damage quite a lot. And it seems to be already. Seems to be doing a good job of upping our damage. With our insane fire rate, it's really helping out. Right, keep going here. Ah, the purple fucking fire got me. Oh my god. I've never seen Satan's leg that far up. Satan's thigh. So Satan's leg's still about, isn't it? Or maybe not? Yes, it is. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe not. No, no, no. It's 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 here. It's just biding its time. Okay. We're good on the Satan front. Oh, no. Okay, double adversary's really bad because they've got this laser beam attack. This one here is fine, this attack. The laser beam attack, however, when there's two of them is going to be really hard for us to dodge. Yep. Knew it. Because you kind of have to loop around them when there's two of them. You can't really do that. Should be fine here, though. Good, good. Oh, my God, an item that does things. Who would have ever believed it could have been possible? Uh, oh my god, we keep getting sharp key. I don't want sharp key. Also, no, I don't, the scoop, no. Oh my god. Items be bad today. Items be bad. <laughs> I could go with the pinwheel. Fuck it, why not? Ah. <laughs> uh. I love chaos. I love it. Getting a two fire rate with this craziness. Ooh, we got we got two really good items here as well. Ah, oh, damn, we don't have a bomb left. With herming, I just thought it'd actually be kind of a good idea. We fire out a whole bunch more tears and we hit everything in a widespread. Of course, it's going to be terrible for the boss. I think maybe Pinwheel should up your damage a little bit as well, personally. Because it does make it incredibly hard to hit shots, even if you're firing more of them. Oh, no. These rock enemies need fixing. Luckily, we, we killed them with a black heart, but they, they need sorting out. So far, so good, though. This is going well. Homing is... Homing plus piercing is, is like, what you need for this. Does make it a little harder to hit our power shots, but I won't. I won't complain too much about that. Oh God, this is many monstros, all of which are firing and jumping. Don't really know how I haven't been hit yet. I mean, somehow we managed that <laughs> before the timer as well. Wait a minute. Itchy nose. It's, the, it's Isaac time, so my nose is like... Ah, yes. It's that time of day again. The nose. It must itch. The brain has some sort of weird affliction with making my nose itch while I'm playing Isaac. It's not even really... Ha it doesn't even really happen with other games. It does happen when I'm recording a lot, but like... It doesn't even really happen when I'm recording other games that much. It's mainly... Oh my god, it's so bad. It's mainly just Isaac.
Oh, damn. I forgot he could do that. Don't do it again. Don't do it again. He did it again. You fiend. More damage for me. <laughs> oh, hello. Wasn't expecting that. Oh, my God. Health is looking pretty bad right now. Not so great. Not so great. Degas. Degas. Yeah, we don't really have the money for this either. Oh, actually, we have the money for that. Oh my god. I did not realize how insane that was there. That was back there. Probably should have played into that a little bit, really, shouldn't I? Oh well. Right, let's go and try and do the boss with this pinwheel madness. Gotta say, the pinwheel is just hilariously fun. Hilariously fun. Monstro, but I just fought, I just fought so many monstros. Give me a break. Got him. I use black rune. Ha ha. Ow. Ha ha, you can't steal my coins if I have no coins. Found a way around it. I found a loophole. But yeah, it really doesn't matter which way we look or fire at the moment. Hey, a luck penny. Nice. Might be able to take my coin away. You can never take my luck away. I think we, uh, yeah, you got, you got two of them unlocked then. I don't mind. I don't mind. Ah! Yeah, this is just kind of a waiting game because we, can, we don't really have any control over whether we hit him or not. Just focus on dodging. And we'll see what comes of it sort of thing. The herming definitely helps. But our big damage shots don't get herming. Right. I see you up there. Got him. I can't believe we only have six coins coming down here. Uh, we we just got a lot more damage from, from our... Uh, $3 bill, though. I don't know what gave us it, but some item gave us a ton more damage. That's all the bombs. Okay, there you go. This, one, this is one of the ones that we need. The piercing one gives us so much extra damage on him. Haha, -ha, I snuck by you and got my damage back. Got my coins back, sorry. So focused on saying damage. There you go. Here it is again. Here it is once again. It gets a bit glitchy, but it does kill everything very quickly. Even the people coming out that door. I'll rush out the door straight into death. Yeah, the we sort sort of just waiting for certain three dollar bill rolls for how well we do. This one is probably the best roll. Probably the best roll. Yeah, that's actually the first time we've been hit that we didn't recover health back for at least. Wow, that was a very close dodge. Very close dodge indeed. But yeah, it kind of doesn't matter how close we are to him either. Like, I feel, I've, I've sort of trying to think maybe if we get closer to him, it'll be easier to hit him. It's the first time I've had Fire Mind in this fight. Uh, but that doesn't really seem to be the case. It's kind of just luck of the draw, really, isn't it? It's kind of just luck of the draw. <laughs> I kind of love it. But I'm, I'm, like, determined to win a run with Pinwheel. Did I just take a full heart of damage for that hit? Belschnickel. Sometimes you don't take a full heart of damage, sometimes you do. Okay, he's gone, like, full... Invincibility mode, because there's so many enemies about. I didn't know he did that. It's interesting. Stop with the hearts, dude. I've almost got you down. He, he absorbed those so quickly. Sometimes it takes forever to absorb them. Other times it's like, nah, straight away, man. Ah. Oh, the dodges. Hey, so that's through the first phase. Of course, second phase is really where it actually starts to get difficult, so... We can't really rate our chances on the first phase. Okay. That slam was a bit more fat than I was expecting it to be. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, the uh, the stone hit me. So we're probably dead. 
Ah, oh, yes, we're dead. I kind of forgot how bullshit... Yeah, 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 we're dead. I get it. I get it, greed. I kind of forgot how bullshit phase two greedier is. I was thinking, like, a normal human, and that this would actually be fair, balanced, and fun, rather than bullshit, bullshit, and more bullshit, which is what it actually is. Also, the game seems to have slowed down dramatically because of all the visual effects going on on the floor. Greedy mode seems to be the, the absolute worst for, for taking a hit on FPS. Please stop, my dude. You're miles away. Look how far that hit is, is, was away from us. Either way, that was a fun run. I like to take pinwheel when we get the chance. It's just, it's one of those meme items, isn't it? I do love it. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy this one, and I will see you guys in the next one.